So I'm sure you've seen the announcements from NVIDIA of all these amazing new things coming in NVIDIA broadcast. You've got the green screen, the noise filter, the auto frame. It's looking pretty good. If you've got a card that can, you know, do those things, an RTX card, is not something everybody has and although this is not everything that the nvidia broadcast can do the auto frame feature that i saw is something that's already available out there in another free program that anybody can use it's called snap camera and it looks kind of like this and i'm going to show you where to get it and how easy it is to set up So if you go to snapcamera.snapchat.com, I've put the link in the description. Download that program and set it up with your webcam. And you can see here, I've got mine uh, set up with my DSLR. And if I go into the settings, you'll want to choose your camera in here. I've got my Camlink 4K. One thing that I will note, if you try and set this up with OBS already running, it's going to be weird about it. You need to have the access of your camera going in the snap camera first because you can add snap cam then into OBS afterwards. One other thing to note is it does not do beyond 1080p. So you can see there the camera resolution is 1920 by 1080p, 60 FPS. And you can even choose a microphone for it because it will affect your microphone as well. Now I've not actually set that up myself, but it's worth checking out. Another cool feature that you can do is you can actually set that up in here where you just trigger a lens effect because this one does need to be triggered or if it doesn't need to be triggered you can go up in the favorites where you've favorited the lenses you like and you can have toggles for the hotkeys on them in here it's pretty good and as you can see it's following my face right now but i can have it follow my portrait a bit less aggressively i can bring that right out and just have it follow me a wee bit like this is crazy like look look at this pretty versatile and you don't need to have RTX set up to do that. Check it out, give it a try, mess around with it if it's something you want to use. Check out my other video where I went through a lot of other interesting filters that you can try and set up with say Instructbot and Leorum board and just different ways to get your chat to interact with your stream in really creative styles. Defrag and to all of the content creators, keep creating. Okay, bye.